Hello friends welcome to our video first subscribe to our channel so you don't need to search our videos thank you. This system looks much stronger than before and will move further north during the next 48 hours. Cindy has not changed much in organization during the last several hours, with the low-level center located near the western or northwestern edge of the main convective mass. While this mass has decreased in coverage this evening, that has not yet resulted in a significant decrease in the satellite intensity estimates. Thus, the initial intensity is held at a possibly generous 60 miles per hour, 50 knots. Satellite imagery shows strong southwesterly upper-level winds blowing toward the cyclone, which is resulting in 20 to 30 knots of shear over the system. Cindy has slowed its forward speed a little with the initial motion now 315 fifteenths of a knot. A low to mid-level ridge to the northeast and east of the cyclone should continue to steer it generally northwestward for the next couple of days. The new track forecast is basically an update of the previous forecast and lies just to the left of the various consensus models. Cindy should pass well northeast of the northernmost leeward islands tomorrow into Monday. The intensity forecast is a tale of two parts. The first part, which is high confidence, is that the current strong shear will continue for another 36 to 48 hours, causing Cindy to weaken. This will most likely result in the cyclone degenerating to a trough or broad low pressure area between 48 to 60 hours. The second part, which is lower confidence, involves the possibility of regeneration after 72 hours. The majority of the guidance suggests the possibility that Cindy will find an area of lighter shear and possibly undergo a favorable interaction with an upper-level trough that would allow the system to regenerate. The GFS is the most aggressive with this development, but all of the models except the ECMWF show it to some degree. A possible regeneration will not be included in the official forecast at this time, but could be added in later advisories. Forecaster Bevan. Information provided by the National Hurricane Center, NHC.